Hey friends, it's Sunday, September 22nd. The time is just after 5 p.m. and the temperature is 23 degrees Celsius. I'm here on Queen's Key West and I'm joined by a Canadian Vasily. We just watched uh, the dominoes fall here down by the lake shore or the harbour front rather. And so now I'm going to explore the aftermath of the dominoes falling and we'll see just how quickly they'll be able to clean up all of these dominoes that fell. Looks like they're already kind of starting to the left of us. But that was awesome. We did a we did a live stream and Vasily joined me for that as well. Check out his channel. Yeah, they're already uh, clearing them out just to the left of us. But it was uh, great to be joined by Vasily and he's going to walk with me for a little bit here. We're going to kind of... have to open up the streets and everything. Yeah, yeah, they closed off some, some streets for this as well. It was pretty intense. If you haven't... Fort York, they closed off. Right, yeah. That's a pretty busy street. I know. The traffic is uh, probably a bit worse than usual. <laughs> I mean, it's still o it's always bad, but events like this kind of make it a bit worse. Oh, we've got some dominoes to the left. So you can see, I think it might have went through this building. That's what it looks like. The community center here, look at that. Yeah, that's really cool. And then it came out with this building and it looks like it went into the basketball court there as well. So it's really cool that we uh, we caught it in the stream. Oh yeah, as you can see over here as well. So now the cleanup begins. So we're going to continue walking west along Queen's Key West here. And I think we're going to head up to Bathurst and check out what was happening there as well. <laughs> Sorry if I'm not the best at uh, talking in this video. I just finished up a live stream, as I said, and that kind of took a lot out of me. So I may be jumbling my words, but don't mind me. I'm just trying to see which way I want to go up. Maybe we'll cross over here. We've got the 509 Harborfront bus and a complimentary shuttle as well to the airport. Oh, people sure uh, cleared out fast. So if you're interested in seeing that live stream of the dominoes falling off the canoe, feel free to check it out. It certainly is windy. It's not friendly to my hair right now. <laughs> the breeze coming off of the lake. Gonna Maybe I'll pop into uh, somewhere and grab a coffee. It's a bit later than I'd like, so I might have to get a decaf or a strawberry acai. There's another 509 bus headed to exhibition. I think I want to head up to Bathurst Bridge here. The dominoes began to fall at 4.30. Here we are at Lakeshore Boulevard. And it started at Niagara and Wellington area. You can see some more dominoes across the street there. Oh. 
this man that shouldn't be on the sidewalk <laughs> was asking me to move out of the way. <laughs> Actually gonna just see if I can put my phone away. I've got to keep my hair out of my <laughs> my eyes here. Quick. Yep, the aftermath. You can see some of the volunteers here in the yellow shirts. Some may say Sundays are boring, but this is the exception. This wasn't boring at all. <laughs> We're actually coming up to the spot where I sniped Toronto Tech and Transit as he was waiting for me at the Starbucks up ahead here. Oh, there's some more. Dominoes just to the right of us. They really did clear them out fast. That's what Vasily was mentioning. They waste no time in the cleanup. Yeah, the street's back up and running. Yeah, it's like nothing ever happened except for the traffic being worse, like I mentioned, a bit worse. You got all these buses just to the left. We are all connected, that's what this mural says. So we're headed north of Bathurst currently. And just right here is where I found Toronto Tech and Transit waiting for me. Which was pretty funny to run into him if you've watched that video. I snuck up on Henry and he's not easy to uh, sneak up on. So that was kind of yeah, fun. He said it on his yeah. I think he said he was on Instagram. <laughs> he tried to sneak up on me today. Did he? But he was missing the light, so he started running and I heard him. <laughs> so Henry tried to sneak up on Vasily, Destination Toronto, during his stream, but he was not successful. Although, car, by the way. It's oh, not going anywhere. Oh no. I'm walking faster than You me. might as well just keep walking. Honestly. Henry did uh, sneak up on you in the well, though. That was quite the stream. Oh, yeah. I watched it back afterwards. Yeah. But that was a whole operation. He got you good. <laughs> he snuck up on Vasily during a stream, which was really funny to see. So this is Bathurst and Fort York Boulevard. And the silly wants to catch a streetcar, but as you can see, traffic is at a standstill. Look at all those TTC buses. More buses. <laughs> That's gonna be a while. Walking is probably gonna be faster at this point. <laughs> my legs are oh yeah, and Vasily has done how many steps was it? I think it was like 35,000 steps. So I'm not sure how he's still standing beside me. <laughs> Almost 38. Almost 38,000 steps. This guy does not stop. <laughs> you definitely need to put your feet in an ice bath when you yeah, get home. I'll just not wake up tomorrow. Oh my goodness. But he did an awesome live stream. And he's very close to being uh, able to receive super chats and offer memberships, awesome. which is very exciting. So this is where I was gonna walk through earlier. You all know how much I love this bridge and the train spotting. It looks like the dominoes went over the railing there at the library, the Fort York branch. Oh, that's a follow we didn't capture. Yeah. We weren't able to capture this one just from where we were standing, but. 
That's a bigger fall than the canoe. That's pretty crazy. But there's no people there. When is yeah, it? you'd have to stand on this bridge, right? I think where we were was more exciting, the, the canoe. It's crazy they have to climb up there, though. Yeah, yeah. So you can see. Probably, yeah, if it had to go. Yeah. Some more cleanup happening here. Oh. The pocket, too. <laughs> very, very closely. You squint and hope oh, for the yeah. best. And if it's sunny, yeah. you just guess. To me. Yeah, you just guess. <laughs> Vasily's commenting on the size of my Pocket 2 camera. The screen is very small, but you kind of just hope for the best and <laughs> you find out when you're editing if it's good or not. <laughs> so this is where I see most of the trains and it's also my favorite spot of the CN Tower as well okay, at night time it's pretty incredible yeah you, and you don't find many unobstructed views of the CN Tower so I don't see any trains coming but if you ever want a train spot this is a great place to do so so maybe I'll cross over uh, I don't know if we're able to, I was going to cross over to Staff Market because that's where the dominoes began to fall. You can see there's some to the left of us there. And I think there's an event going on at Staff Market as well. I thought I saw something about Afrofest, but I'm not 100% sure. So here we are at Bathurst and front. No shortage of honking. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna go to where it started. Just past stacked here. There's an Audi R8 that just came past. Maybe we'll cross over here. A very noisy Audi R8. So this is stacked Blue Moon Brewery in front of us. They hold a lot of events here. It's funny online, Vasily and I were joking because they said human-sized dominoes, but <laughs> they're about two feet tall. So not very human-sized. <laughs> I would say a bit below the knee. Yeah, well, I noticed on most posters it was saying life-size. Yeah, <laughs> right. <laughs> so we had some mixed... Uh, yeah, mixed information. And yes, Vasily pointed out that he was disappointed the dominoes aren't painted black or the classic domino pattern that you would find. They're just plain concrete, as you can see. But it looks like they have cleared out most of the dominoes here. This was full earlier when I walked past during the live stream. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Feel free to give it a like, subscribe, leave a comment, let me know your thoughts. I also have an Instagram account and a Twitter, it's Walks with T-Shods. Feel free to follow me there as well. And I have memberships available. There's a join button next to the subscribe button, as well as a link in my description. I wanna thank Vasily for continuing to walk with me. He's probably at 40,000 steps by now. <laughs> uh, check him out on YouTube, Destination Toronto. I'll have his link in the description as well. And if I sit down, I won't be able to stand up. Oh my goodness, so let's so, get Vasily home <laughs> in yeah. one piece here.
All right, everyone. Thanks so much. I have to so get much. to the subway at least. And seeing streetcar in nowhere, I might reach Spadina. Oh, yeah, probably. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time. How funny is it that I ended up in front of Domino's to close out oh, the wow. video here? It's going to be hard to deck with, like, the stylized. The Domino's should have sponsored <laughs> Pun it intended. Missed opportunity. <laughs> All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye, everyone. Thanks for watching.